Don't watch the setup. <laughs> it's just a corridor setup. Directly in front of my tent, there's a river there. So there is a river directly in front of my tent. Uh, I'll show you guys first thing in the morning one sign up. So let me show you guys. This is like the most basic setup ever. So I have a blanket that stretches the length of the tent. I'll be sleeping on that side. Have a nice little pouch thing here that I can put my phone and some of the camera things in. And on this side i just have my bags there for now it's a pretty basic setup <laughs> uh, hopefully in the future I, I intend to do a lot more camping in the future so hopefully by then i will have more i will have more equipment for camping but for now this will have to do <laughs> Let me serve as a gentle reminder that even though it's the morning hour, we still brush our teeth before we head to bed. 
as I told you guys, it's been an extremely long day. Uh, now I'm just sitting at the door of the tent or the opening of the tent <laughs> and just admiring just admiring the sky uh, it might sound weird but back in the city we don't really get a sky like this I can't tell the last time I saw so many stars and the GoPro won't be able to pick up the stars but <laughs> <laughs> strange is like you forget how many stars they are until you actually experience it again it's fascinating I tell you Truth. I'm not sure if it's because I was tired but last night I slept like a baby <laughs> I don't know if it's the the sounds of the, the river or the sounds of the night but it was a peaceful rest <laughs> Alright guys, it's it's a bit strange because you'd expect the river water to be cold but for some reason it's not. so beautiful here I did not I'm being honest I did not expect the water to be that warm <laughs> it's extremely warmer than expected so I'm going to get my things and go get ready to get an early morning show well yeah welcome back to the channel guys welcome back to another adventure if this is your first time consider subscribing remember to leave a like on the video and a comment let me know what you think about the experience while i wait to go get my shower i thought i'd just use this time to talk to you guys so <laughs> camping has always been something i've wanted to do on the channel uh, but i haven't gotten around to it because i didn't have the equipment that i needed so a few days ago 
I saw this ad on Instagram about this camping trip and I decided what the hell I'm going to take the Maroons camping so I signed up for it made the payment and <laughs> two days two days later here we are so we are camping in St. Mary it's along the the Rio Sombre if that's not it I think it's the Rio Sombre river that we are that we are along hopefully I can have like a nice fun weekend and uh, showcase it to you guys a lot of you guys might not have experienced the camp life before so this is a good way to kind of give you a feel of what it what you can expect dipping my toes in the pool a bit because I intend to get my own camping equipment I intend to get my own tent my own sleeping bag all of that jazz so that I can do like solo camping trip for you guys well I'm never alone with you guys I always have the maroons with me so anytime I'm out here it's not me alone is the whole 568 of them plus me yeah that's the plan but in due time we will get the relevant equipment and the right equipment so that we can take on this thing full hard but for now we're just tagging along to, this to get an understanding of what are some of the things that we're going to be made because I plan to be camping and cooking and all of that excitement so if you guys are interested in that remember to subscribe here for it so I came up to another section of the river right here uh, it seems to be a deeper swimming spot but it's a bit silty at the moment so I don't think we'll be going in there well at least not for now Let's utilize this stone right here. Come on. <laughs> that was one of the most refreshing showers I've ever had. Hey Maroons, nothing beat a cool refreshing shower in the morning. <laughs> nothing. Morning. gonna get dressed so no I'm fully dressed I kind of kind of cleaned out the tent a bit and the Sun is coming out there so I'm gonna go over here so I look see what over here is like this old building I'm not sure what it is uh, but yeah basically it's just a big open space that you can use for camping this little bridge here uh, I'm not going to cross because I'm not sure if over there is private property but yeah it leads around to this bridge and as you can see the river continues down that way oh down this will look nice though under the trees i think i've explored this section so i'm just heading back around to camp now uh, hopefully they're about to start breakfast probably just snack on something in the time being oh what's that building let's see if we can go up on top of the building there all right
Nice building. There's my tent right here. This is mine at the front right there. <laughs> oh. It's actually a really beautiful location. Nice location actually. So I'm back in the tent guys. As I say, this is a learning experience for me. So something you want to ensure when you go camping, I'm learning now is that you try to set up as best as possible where there might be cover because at the moment the sun is coming over and once it's high inside the tent is going to be extremely hot inside the tent is going to be extremely hot if you don't have cover so that's something to bear in mind if you can get some shade from the sun that would be a good spot to set up tent So guys, I'm just having a quick snack before before breakfast is ready because I just started making I just started making breakfast. So it's going to be a, a while. Um, yeah, I don't know if I mentioned it last night, but the sleep here was so peaceful. Like it was extremely peaceful. Might have something to do with the river and the constant flow in the water and the sound in the day. The wildlife, the soul in the forest, the soul in the cicadas. Just top tier environments to sleep in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, the, the, the ten city already? Yeah, man. <laughs> Ganda. Eh? No man, if you just want to touch the screen and it come back up. Relax man. I respect. So maroons, <laughs> so yet another jelly on the channel. Mm. <laughs> Jelly water, I'll know in a reach in a plastic. <laughs> Split it in a tree. Watch it! Yeah. Alright, so my most recent video goes up in a few minutes, it goes up in about 5 minutes uh, That's the video where I went to the waterfall and did the, the Escovich fish <laughs> I was going to push it back until Emancipation Day on the holiday uh, But given that I'm here, I don't have any connection, any internet or any internet connection or service at all So. I don't have the means that I normally use to push out the video and notify and notify particular. 
clear given that i'm off grid i don't have that option so it's going to be interesting to see when i get home when i get home in a few days how many views the video would have the views the videos would have gotten and how many persons would have actually interacted with it without me telling them remember to hit the notification button so that once the video goes live you get notified so that you can always be one of the first maroons to check it out we're just waiting on breakfast to be finished we're going to be having cornmeal porridge uh some bread some baked bean so so that's going to be a whole vibe uh i'm not sure if i'm going to be splitting this into different videos depending depending on what we do i might split it into separate videos but let's see I actually finished the breakfast about about two hours ago <laughs> just been chilling since uh, it was basic we had porridge uh, I'm not the biggest fan of porridge and my least favorite is actually cornmeal that's what we had it was good though uh, I had two cups in fact some have the fact that I drank two cups means that it was good so now just chilling kind of have a slight headache uh, the tent is too hot. It's too hot <laughs> So I'm just chilling I'm just chilling up this area for a bit then I'll go back down Alright guys, so while I was here chilling I just got informed that we're going to be doing an upstream a hike which sounds like a vibe uh, Currently, they don't know what to expect. So we're just going to hike the river explore the river to see to see what we find to be strapping the guys to my chest as a matter of fact I'm going to do a separate video on that so hope you guys enjoyed this one sorry for the abrupt end to it but i feel like this makes sense it makes sense i split this in two so remember to subscribe leave a like let me know what you think and let me know what you think if you're excited for the next part remember my runes in everything that you do be patient exercise humility and always be consistent see you in the next video I know you never gonna believe me But me with a funny time to keep this thing a secret Cause yeah, got me going to the deepest of oceans Come and let me show you why you feel like a float fun Slow jams why you feel like Listen, anything you turn in a real life fixing Not touching, girl, you're my addiction Cause with you I feel I'm missing Nothing, 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 nothing